at the Grove Arcade in Asheville, North Carolina today. You'd think you're in a church as fancy as this place is. Really a beautiful building. Look at the walkway. The whole place. So it was originally built by Mr. Grove and he died and they uh, stopped building it for a while. And then they took back up building it in the late 20s. So the building is almost 100 years old. But you can see they put a lot of detail into it. And it's all local shops. So it's like a mall. A lot of local goods from North Carolina. And look at the spiral staircase, the way they came out. It's got a glass ceiling. All the wrought iron. Pretty good sized building. So this shows you all the different shops that there are here. In downtown Asheville, the old part of town. There's a lot of really cool architecture in this town. So this is kind of a neat use. This is probably the telephone booth. <laughs> At one time, of course, there's no pay phones anymore. So this is what they did. Last shopping, shopping arcades constructed in the United States. Died of malaria. Well, this is interesting. 42, the federal government took this over uh, in an effort to win World War II because it was large, located in a safe, remote place. 74 shops and 127 offices were evicted with less than a month's notice. And then after the war, the arcade continued under federal ownership and eventually became the headquarters for the National Climatic Data Center for 50 years. And the public facade was shuttered as distinctive windows bricked over. Then in the 70s, they uh, opened it back up as Pretty much what you see here now, I guess. This part down here looks like a church. Look at the entrances and the, over the windows and everything. This is kind of neat in uh, downtown Asheville. There's a community garden here. Some kind of unique looking structures that people have planted flowers and vegetables in. Big construction project over here where we parked the truck. You got to feed the meters with a two hour limit and they take quarters and there's no change machine. <laughs> and this is the line for the Asheville Pinball Museum. They open at two and it's probably what about five of or so. So if you're enjoying the videos folks, please like, share, but most importantly, subscribe. You'd be amazed what you'll see if you get off the couch. Have a great day.